video. Peace. <laughs> it's always peace even when it's chaos. <coughs> even with dealing with the Mr. Chaos, you must maintain your peace. You know? Um understanding granted that we do um have to deal with some type of chaos and we do have to deal with some type of peace but understand peace is a choice and dealing with chaos it's going to depend on the kind of peace you keep so if you're a peaceful person and you're trying to maintain your peace you're going to deal with chaos a certain type of way um but that's just my you know my overstanding of things um but this conversation is about uh this uh quote-unquote holiday that I don't even call a holiday because if I don't get the day off, it ain't a real holiday. Uh, but I'm talking about Valentine's Day. Now, love is not, or loving your significant other or just showing love is not one day out of the year. It's just not, you know. Um, and I can't wait for the day that people get over this propaganda type of holiday. Um, I mean, all holidays is propaganda, but this one in particular is just... It's like, man, you know, and it's not no hate involved. It's not none of that. It's just, it's just an overhyped day. You know, you can show love any type of day. Uh, for one, everything is overpriced. You know, your bottle of wine that costs $20 costs $50 on this day. Your roses that cost $10 cost $20 on this day. You know, it's just, it's just too extra, you know, um, and uh, and Valentine's it's just it's it's a it's a whatever day. It's some man-made shit. Um, not really sure where it originated from, and I really don't care. I know that it ain't never been my thing. Um, but you know, for for the for the sake of uh perceptions, um, because certain people might not be on my level. Um, I'll entertain it to a s extent. Like, listen, you're not getting a bottle of wine and we're not going out to eat. None of that. You know, I'll get you a box of chocolates and a balloon. Right? That's it. And maybe a bottle from the liquor store. That's it. Maybe. Right? But other than that, I mean, listen, I'm not, I'm not going all out. With a dozen roses and a two dozen roses and candlelight dinners. Nah. I think I did that shit once in my life. And for me to do it that one time, I realized, I'm like, why am I spending all this money on this one day to make this girl or woman that I'm dealing with make her feel extra special when I go out my way every other day to make this woman feel extra special? But why I gotta emphasize it on this one particular day? Over it. Um, it is what it is. Like I'm not knocking it. If you celebrate it, you celebrate it. That's your thing. It just really ain't mine. So like I said, I entertain it to an extent. You know, past couple of years, you know, my daughter got her little box of chocolates with a cartoon character on the front. Oh, thank you, Daddy. Happy Valentine's Day. Cool. Put a, a smile on my daughter's face. Even my baby mom's when we was cooler. You know. Here's a box of chocolates and a balloon. You know, just, you know, and she, she, uh, maybe two, maybe a few years she hasn't appreciated it, but it's some years that I guess she maybe has. I mean, whatever the case may be. My focus ain't really about that. My focus is on what I can do for that woman if I'm dealing with you every day to make it a special day for you. You know, if, if I'm with you, I'm with you. And if, you know, if I want to buy you chocolates randomly, if I want to buy you flowers randomly, if I want to take you out to eat randomly, I'm going to do that. I'm going to show Valentine's Day on a regular, not just one day out the year. But that's just me in particular. I mean, like I said, I'm not knocking. You know, if that's your thing, yo, you want to go all out, you want to do the proposal, you know, get the ring, and this, this is your special day where you want to do all that, do you. But it ain't for me. And that's my piece.